Good morning. It's a new day. This is the 3rd of March. Pretty sure it's the 3rd. <coughs> anyway, the fire's going very nicely. And my pot of water is getting hot. I think it's time to turn down the fire, actually. Whoa, look at that. It's 900. I'll shut it down. And my water is heating up so that I can have some of this lovely tea. I'll get my, my cup over here. I think I can do this without dropping anything on my lap. some of this lovely tea from um, Haiku. Thank you so much Haiku. I think it's giving me energy. Herb tonic tea. Herb tonic extract, glucose, and caramel. And she said what the name of it is, but I forget it. So, if I can do this again without and down it goes into my little stash. It's a very interesting tea. It tastes good. Steamy hot. All right, let's snuggle back here into my chair. Lean back and the legs come up. Thank you, Haiku. It's very tasty. Don't need any honey or sugar in it. I guess that's the glucose in it. But it also, I think it helps. I think it's giving me more energy. We can always use a little more energy. It's early in the morning. I couldn't get up in time to take my son to make his breakfast and lunch. I asked if he'd do it and he's quite capable of stuff. So he did and I was going to go for a walk but it's zero Fahrenheit which is negative 18 Celsius. I just couldn't make myself do it. I'm a little sluggish today. Hence the tonic water, the tonic tea. <coughs> <coughs> I really like this idea of teacups for geraniums. Now I need more brackets so I can put more of those little shelves up across in front of each window. And I can leave, I can take the shelves down and leave the brackets up. <coughs> so whenever I want to plant things in the fall or in the spring I can just pull out my shelves and I don't have to um, worry about that they're so pretty aren't they my mother has a whole lot of teacups that she's been saving forever and I was she wanted to know if I wanted them you know she's getting getting on in years and I was couldn't think what I was going to do with them because I'm not really a I, I drink my drink in mugs because I like to drink a lot of water, a lot of liquid, not just a little teacup. And I have this great collection of them too. Oh, the other day, Willem, Willem did something funny. He 
there was a hanger hanging. See over there? I don't know if you could see it or not, but there's a string in front of the Christmas tree. I haven't even turned on the Christmas tree yet. I'm really sluggish this morning. Anyway, he hung, there was this hanger hanging there, and I noticed it, and I was going to ask him what the hanger was there for. And then later in the day, um, I saw him touching the hanger, and I said, what's that hanger doing there for? And he said, oh, I put it here to see if you would notice it. I noticed it, and I said, well, that's a good idea, Will, and that's really cool, doing things like that to see if I notice a change. You could, you should do that other thing, other times, too. And he looked around the room, you know, which is absolutely chock full of everything. Everything, everywhere. <clears throat> and I said, you could, you know, you could do something little, like, um, switch the Switzerland mug with the Rotterdam mug. <laughs> As if I would actually notice that. I would not even notice if the cobwebs were all missing. I would say, Willem, where's that cobweb? That it had two lines on it, and now I don't see it. Did you did you do something with that? He's so much fun. It's nice to have a sweetheart, isn't it? <laughs>